Number 16, verify that the SI unit of H rho G is Newton per meter squared. All right, so what I'm going to do is, since I'm showing that they're equivalent, I'm going to create like a little equation here, okay? So I'm going to write H times the den this is the depth, times the density, multiplied by gravity. These units have to equal the uh, Newton per meter squared, okay? So let's expand on each of these, right? So we know height is represented in meters. We know the density is going to be represented in kilogram per cubic meter. And we know gravity is meter per second squared, right? That's the acceleration due to gravity. Now what I need to do is I'm going to just expand on the Newton, okay? Remember, Newtons represents a force, and F is equal to ma. This is easy now to find out what the units for force in terms of the SI units should be, right? It's mass, which is kilograms, multiplied by acceleration, which is meters per second squared. So basically now I'm just going to take this and throw it on in for the Newton, all right, so this is going to work out to be now kilogram times meter per second squared, all divided by now meters squared. Okay, so from here now, all I'm going to be doing is some simplifications. All right, so notice that this meter right over here is really over one, and I have two meters on the top, and I have three on the bottom, so both of them will cancel on the top. This three will reduce down to a one on the bottom. Okay, so what I'm left with is basically kilogram now, right, per meter times second squared. Okay, I'm just trying to show that these two sides are equal to one another. So now when I look at now what I have over here, since these are multiplied in the top, I can basically bring the second squared down to the bottom, right? So I'll do that as my kind of first move. So this is going to be kilogram times meter all over meter squared times second squared. And now what I can do is cancel this meter with one of those meters at the bottom. And lo and behold, what am I left with on the right-hand side? I'm left with kilogram per meter times second squared. Oh, would you look at that? Surprise, surprise, they are identical, right? So therefore, this if this bottom is the same, then I know that this top is also the same thing. Guys, thank you so much, all right? Really appreciate it, uh, your viewership, and look forward to helping you out with more problems. Take care.